go. Here. Bullseye. Here. Oh, what is this, lad? Bullseye. These undead plants there, um, are really something. Time to get serious. Yes, very serious. Bullseye. Got you. There. Huh? Take this. How's this? You're finished. Got you. Bullseye. Yeah. Bullseye. Yeah. Here. Bullseye. Right, so I guess bows yeah. don't work. Here. Got you. Here. On these mushrooms, or maybe that move just has low damage Got output it. because it hits many times. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Well, that heals you nice. Any other treasure chests in this uh, screen? There should be one. According to the tracker. Where oh where could this one treasure chest be? Be this way? And no clue where it can be. Maybe it's this way. Oh, gamer. Pretty good find. I'm a gamer. Defense all guy. Ooh, maybe this is going to take me back to the... Oh, no, it's a mini boss of some kind. Oh, my word. <laughs> that was just like a, a too strong for you enemy. Hit for try after game over to revive in the area before boss battle. Does this work, like, for this mini-boss? The boss's armor will fall by 10%. Ooh, I don't want that. I don't want that at all. Oh, I'm all the way back here because that didn't count as a boss. I mean, like, we didn't hey. do much at all. Alright. We are not gonna want to go there, then. Luckily, this game has auto saves, so like you can't really um. What should I look up? I have to do this again, I think. No, I don't actually. We're good. Uh, goodbye. Feeling stronger now. Feeling much stronger. Behold my Trinity. Bullseye. Oh, that thing attacks. Don't, yeah, don't let it. that get near me. <laughs> this came right after you said I'm a gamer. Hey, my point still stands. I, I got destroyed happily. <laughs> yep. Thank you. All right, we have to go to that path. We're just not going to fight that enemy right now. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to just get killed there. Mine? This will come in handy. Just don't go down there. Maybe we'll come back to it if I remember. Yay! I'm gonna butcher this name. Ragos? Rigos? Is how I'm gonna pronounce it. Welcome to stream. How's it going? I'm hoping this game is good. I mean, I'm I'm in I'm a little over an hour in. It seems really Bullseye. it seems interesting. Alright, we're here. But now what? I do think it's probably gonna have a specific niche because like it's it's kind of based on like games from the 90s, so it might not be for everyone. Like I'm, I'm enjoying it so far. It's pretty, it's a pretty neat game so far. First things first. Did you know that triggers can transform into weapons? Yeah, Flom's already turned into a sword. But is a sword all you really need? Well, I, I wouldn't mind being able to choose the right weapon for the right situation. I'll bet. And with triggers, you can do just that. While you can only summon a single trigger, they'll equip you with a full arsenal. I never would have guessed. We triggers are born from the world of Trinitia itself. 
Thus we draw on its power to use as our own, as do the gods' divine weapons. Whoa! And we can take advantage of that ability by imbuing our triggers with an Arma's power. The places where we can absorb this power are called altars. Now that you mention it, I did see something like that back near Woodroost. Well, we call them altars, but no one knows who built them or what purpose they originally served. What we do know is that performing a ritual there lets our triggers use an Arma's power. Specifically, it allows us to transform into a weapon identical to the Arma. So... We're here to get our hands on that power? Bingo! Now let's go find that altar. Okay, then. I like the, um... Right. I like the lore setup of the game so far. Ta. What platform are you playing on? Playing on PlayStation. Yeah. PS5. There is a PS5 version. I was gonna say PS4 version on my PS5, but there is an actual PS5 version which I'm playing. Actually, I think I got. I think I um I bought the game digital because uh I went to GameStop to pick it up because I, I discovered this game yesterday. I was not expecting to play this game like at all. I didn't even know the game existed until yesterday. But, um, they didn't have it at my local GameStop, so I had to buy it digitally. And when I got it digitally, I think they gave me the PS4 version with the PS5 version for, like, $50. I think it was $50. It wasn't a full price game. Like, it wasn't, like, $60. So, I have both versions, but I'm currently playing the PS5 version. I think it's also on Switch, this game. And probably Steam? I know it's on Switch for sure. There, there. I'm brimming with energy. Bullseye. Got you. There. Fine. Got you. Similar to Secret of Mana. Oh yeah, very much like Secret of Mana. I'm pretty sure Secret of Mana is like. Here, there. Bullseye. Pretty sure like the people working on this game were like going for something like Secret of Mana. They got the stamina gauge like Secret of Mana. Here, there. And just the combat in general, the view, very much like Secret of Mana. So, like, if you if you like mana games, I'd say this game might be worth a shot. I'm gonna be honest, Secret of Mana. I wasn't really, I'm not really a big fan of Secret of Mana, the original. I also wasn't a fan of the original Trials of Mana or Legend of Mana, but I loved the Trials of Mana remake. And the art style of this game looked really nice, which is why I'm playing it. Does it have PS5 specific features? Oh, like uh, haptics and stuff? No, not that I know this. No, nothing like uh, nothing like that. I don't think. Hey, vampire bats in the bow song only drop items if you defeat them with a sword. Some enemies will only drop certain items when defeated by specific weapons. See your adventure log for details. I'll light this yeah. up. Hey guys, how's it going? Bullseye. Pretty good find. The bullseye, by the way. <laughs> That's not gonna get old. They don't. Dumb bat. Thanks for the follow, Ragos. Thanks for the info, no problem. Thanks for the follow. Greatly appreciate it. These streams all go on my YouTube channel. I will be uploading these tomorrow. This will come in handy. This is probably a game that falls under a lot of people's radar. Like not I mean, considering that I found out about it yesterday. So I'm hoping that my playthrough will get some attention. Because of that. Up here we go. Got you. They don't. No, you don't. Oh, I already got the chest. I came back here thinking I need to get more chests. My turn now. We could play as Elise for a bit. Got you. There. You did not get anything. What are you talking about? This should be pretty useful. I can't see, Got dude. Can I have like one of those mushrooms? Bullseye. Yeah. Take this. How's this? You're 
I can't see with all this darkness. This is like ease in the blind status ailment, whatever it was called. And now that I think about it, it was probably just for a chest. I'm a simple guy. I see people play JRPGs and follow. Or I see JRPGs. Oh, well, you're in the right place. My... I play platformers too. And like, I'm playing Forbidden West's Burning Shores. And I played the main game of Forbidden West, but... I am 90% JRPGs. Maybe 85. Got you. There. Got you. There. Got you. Bullseye. If I'm not playing a JRPG, it's like a platformer or sometimes a relatively modern adventure game. Was this poison I have? Take that, right I did not mean to use that. That's not what I meant to do. I press triangle because triangle is like the common menu button in games. But in this game, it uses your trinity attack. There, got you. Time to get serious. Bullseye here. There. I'm really confused what the square thing does. I thought the square thing was needed for the trinity attack, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, hello. This is, uh, these are gonna be the glyphs I use later. I need to be able to see. <laughs> Bullseye! There! Got you! Here! There! Alright. You have a, uh, trinity thing with, uh... With Cyan. Here! Bullseye! There! I'm just running in circles, dude. I have no idea where to go. Yeah, stay lit. Bum, 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 bum. Huh. Oh, yeah. I'm dumb. Destroy this. Yeah. There we go. Just solved it. Here. Got you. Hey, uh, eat this. <laughs> Love it. Here. Bullseye. Damn. Here. I'm really hurting. Alrighty, let's get going. No problem. Just potion. Don't mind me. I, I didn't need to do that. There was a healing mushroom right there. Oh well. Bullseye! Got you! Here! Got you! Bullseye! That's for light. Which one do you like? Oh, platformers? I... I, I play a lot of platformers. Crash Bandicoot, Klonoa... Um, I'm playing through the Mega Man Zero series, like, replaying it, to name a few. I would highly recommend checking out my YouTube channel, because I have a good amount of platformers on there. And just games in general. Is this the altar we're looking for? Nope. It's not glowing, so it's inactive. What do you mean by that? They take decades to recharge after one use. Ah, meaning someone else got here first and used it to power up their trigger. Right. You have to use an altar while it's glowing. Also, each altar has its own element, so only triggers of the same element can use it. So I need to find a fire altar? Indeed. And I would need one attuned to water. In other words... If we find a fire altar, then Flom can turn into a bow. Exactly. All right, then let's keep looking for one. All right, then. What's this? Yeah. Nothing. Find another altar. Can I, can I like, see, though? I need a light mushroom. Thank goodness the uh, glowing weapons is helping a little bit for the light. Did you play Ori? Oh, Ori and the Wisps or whatever? I actually never played that. Maybe one day, though. That was a... I think I remember when that game was coming out. It mildly interested me. I never played it, though, no. It's not too late to want to check it out when I'm looking for, like, a quick platformer to play, though. Pretty good find. Nice. 
Yeah. up. Yeah. Here, bullseye. Got you. Yeah. Bullseye. Yeah, I remember. Uh, I remember seeing a lot of people. Uh, I know a lot of people like the Ori and the. I don't actually know the full title, but Ori and the Wisps or whatever. I know the exact game you're talking about, though. Maybe I will check it out one day. This is the Red Shrine. I never know if this is an enemy, but it is. Here. Got you. This is it. This will come in handy. Super dead. Yeah. Do I not break this? Ready to go. Here. There. We have to use like a different weapon or something. There is like eight weapons in this game. From the weapon ring. What can I craft here? Not much. Just potions. Um, cure slow, cure stun, cure seal, revives target with little HP. I already have one, two of these, so I don't really want to buy more. Poison removal could be interesting. We can get more antidotes. I already have ten, though, but we could just make antidotes for when we need them. This one's glowing. Looks like we can use it. The blue glow means it's a fire altar. <laughs> Perfect for you, Flom. I I'm sorry, what? A blue one means it's a fire one? So, can this thing really power me up? What kind of logic is that? Why the uncertainty? You didn't know that? Oh, yeah. Flom's got a bad case of amnesia. He doesn't remember anything? Is that even possible? Um, yes? I don't know what else to tell you. Hey, Waz, do you think performing that ritual will help him remember anything? Indeed. The Arma alteration may help. The what? I mentioned it before, didn't I? That's the ritual for powering up triggers. All right, Flom, hop on the altar. I'll do it for you now, so pay attention. Next time, you'll perform it yourself. Got it. Oh, great font of all creation. I present thee one of thy kin. That thy supreme power might manifest in him. Grant unto Flom the form of a bow! Flom can now transform into a bow! Okay, so now, uh, what's-his-face, Cyan can use bows. Okay, that wraps up the ritual. How do you feel, Flom? I feel... stronger. Much stronger. Huh? What's up, Flom? <laughs> oh, it's a spider! It was bound to happen at some point! Looks like we've got company. Monsters dead ahead. Perfect timing. Why not put that new power of yours to good use and take them all out? Okay, here goes. All right, giant spider. One could never be too prepared. Actually, no, Cyan. Okay, we have to use the bow. It was R one. You. Need some light though. This is not ideal. There's the light. Hey, Trinity trigger. A Trinity move. The moonlight predator, huh? 